sports segment and uh, with me today well we've already told you who's gonna be with us today haven't we so rather than me mentioning his name look at his face ladies and gentlemen this is mr. Stephen up here aka Capi too good morning good morning how you doing I'm fine be good and let's not forget because obviously the, all the ladies are looking at Capito but uh, my concentration is on the other ones Stacy good morning good morning how are you how are you I'm fine I would really so want you to lose the glasses really to be able to look into your eyes then I can't see oh really I'm joking you can't for you see. yeah this for, just me, for you. just okay. for me today just for Stacy and uh, also we have Gabriella Cranston with us as well good morning, good morning. how are you all doing Awesome. Welcome to the show. Um, now, first off, we're going to be starting with uh, Capito here. You're being honoured this weekend. Congratulations, man. I, I'm one who's personal friend and very proud of what you've been through and what you've achieved. And uh, I believe it's well-deserved. So congratulations to Stacey as well for putting it all together and making Thank sure you. that he is being honoured. Um, Step, how is it not playing football at the moment? I'm cool. I think that... Um I always knew that one day I would stop playing, so I've psyched myself already. Yeah. So now that I'm not, I'm not, I'm not playing. I'm, I'm not taking it any, any hard on me. Mm. But you're still very active in sports. You still work out a lot. Mm-hmm. I, I, well, that, that's according to the ladies, because apparently every time you take off your shirt, the muscles are still there. Nah, it's not. It's not like that. I'm, <laughs> I'm fighting cancer and diabetes. <laughs> so I have to, yeah, I have to wake up in the morning. I have to get myself fit. Yes indeed yeah. all right so um we've also been told sorry ladies we'll get on to you in a second we've also been told that you're going to be joining our black stars um in brazil is that right technical. why are you trying to push me? technical technical director ah, i didn't know about helping. it maybe uh, you see maybe you see it in june yeah yeah all right well i'll be there in june so definitely i'll be behind you sitting behind you so i did the director me try the director <laughs> stacy um You've been doing this award ceremony for a couple of years now, right? yeah. and um, shedding the light on the showbiz people that need some recognition. What's the criteria? What, what goes into selecting the person that you want to honor for the year? Um, the first one, you have to be a celebrity. It's very important. Yep. And you should have been in the industry for at least five years or more. Mm-hmm. And our main focus is on celebrities who are giving back to the society. So if you're not socially responsible, you don't get to get an award. Mm-hmm. And we also look at your international recognition, your home base support and fan base right there in Ghana. And we also look at your nominations for awards because sometimes you're good, but you don't win awards. Mm-hmm. Right. So we actually look at your nominations and your possible awards. If you have any, we look at all of them. So the main concentration is on your contribution towards the society. Okay. So it's more of a charity award. So Stephen here, um, he has a clinic in Choco. He, he set it up for the local people so they could go there, especially for the mothers and children, for their weighing, mm-hmm. their post and prenatal conditions. And he also has a library for the kids. They go there after school to learn. And it's all for free. And he makes it a point to register people on the health insurance scheme. And he also has this step up to school tournament for school kids. Yes. So he's encouraging the kids to love the game of football, yep. but still be in school. Mm-hmm. Good stuff. Gabby, what's your um, involvement in the whole situation? Right, so I'm with Empower Workforce Solutions. Okay. And uh, we've, we're have we pleased to support Stephen uh, in his endeavors. When um, Showbiz Honest approached us, uh, we thought that we could support what Stephen is doing uh, in the underprivileged communities. I think basically his or ultimately his goal is to improve well-being mm-hmm. uh, in the society and the quality of life. And as a workforce solutions company, we've made it our business to match quality people to quality organizations. And we understand that there are some skills in these uh, communities that are untapped. Right. And they're also facing issues like high unemployment because they've not been empowered and they don't understand what uh, opportunities are there for them and that's where we come in. So we will be doing um, a career guidance um, on the 20th of December. Um, Whilst the health screening is going on, we'll be doing career guidance for the youth just to empower them and let them know what opportunities are there for them. Stephen, how's Step Up going? Um... Not bad, going good. Yeah, yeah. More people getting involved. Um, yes. Okay. Now, uh, what is it you are expecting from this particular 
awards ceremony. I mean, obviously you're going to be standing there. A lot of people are going to be there to agree with this award ceremony. Well, first, what's going to um, after? first, I think um, I'm I'm really honored and very grateful that uh, what I'm doing for the, my contribution to society has been recognized. Yeah. I think that it's not only Stephen Appiah. I think that a lot of celebrities they are doing it uh, today. Is Stephen Appiah tomorrow to be someone else? I mean. Uh, let me let me take this opportunity to to uh, I mean thank M Clan for the good work that they are doing because I mean when you are doing you giving something back to society and you don't get uh, any recognition I think that it it, it, it down it downs your morale That's true. but uh, they are doing a good thing so uh, this is going to this platform is going to ginger a lot of people to give more to 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 society yeah uh, I know I know I have a lot of friends I know that. Everybody is calling me. People will be there. Uh, I'm really grateful that they will be there to come and support Stephen Napier. Nice, sir. What's next for your foundation? Uh, any other things that you're going to be getting into that we should know about? Well, I think that for the honestly, for the past two years, uh, we haven't done much. Um, well, you say you haven't done much. We think you have. <laughs> I mean, um, due to to there was an issue with the team, step up team, mm -hmm. um, but we we, we have, we have sorted that uh, issue up. So I think that from next year, uh, you people will see more and you come and support. All right, good stuff, Stacy. Now the award ceremony. Tell us about it. What's what, what can we expect when we walk through the doors? Um, I would say it would be breathtaking when you walk through the doors. And uh, we already started with the celebrations last week in Kumase. We were invited by the Otun for oh, nice. to, to and I thank you very much for inviting us and the Mencia of the MP of Mencia, Dr. Matthew Poku Prempe, they invited us to have the first phase of the free medical screening and career counseling. Okay. And it was awesome. We screened about a thousand people in Mencia for free. And it was amazing that some people came there looking healthy. But after they were checked, they realized they were very not healthy. Yeah. So at least we gave a platform for people to really know where they stood in terms of their health. Tomorrow, Friday on the 20th, we'll be at the Old Girls Park that is in Stevens constituency in Choco. In Choco. Yeah, we'll be there. So I'm inviting Sandra, Ama, and you, Ben. You have to come support us. It will be at 10 a.m. And by that time, we would have closed, right? We close at 10. So, so right after you close, you have to come there. Let's hope that operation traffic let the traffic flow allow us to get there. We'll be there till about 4 p.m. No problem. So we'll be expecting all of you, and we'll be screening people for free. So come get screened for free. We're not taking anything. And Empower Workforce Solution will be there too, Gabriella and her team, and they'll be giving free career guidance and counseling to the youth. So it will be fun. We have a lot of musicians coming to support Steven. Becca will be performing, Nobu nice. Ketia will be performing, Konti Hine will be performing. It's a, it's a whole pack. And we, we have two special men in our nation who will be coming to support. But I just want to keep it under wraps. Yeah, yeah, when you get there on Saturday. Okay. Just let just you guys know, I'm not one of those men, but <laughs> yes, they will all be there. Um, so it's Saturday that's going to be happening. It is an invitation only, isn't it? Yeah. So, um, and those of Stevens fans who would want to come, they can just text APPIAH. A P P I A H two one four zero two. That's for MTN, Vodafone, and Airtel, and okay. they can get opportunities to get invitations. Oh, so they can get invitations. Yeah, as they well. can. Okay, so there you have it. Uh, all you need to do is text that number uh, to appear, and uh, you could win some invites to the awards ceremony as well. So, uh, step step apart from football, what else are we, are, can we expect you to be? doing very soon because the girls are all asking me i've got no worries me uh, we, we talk we talk all the time but the girls are asking when can we see step in shorts again when can we see step with his top off when when when, when? and i can't answer these questions Stephen. don't uh, don't tell me that is amake eh? because yeah, yeah. she's the one always worrying me with yes yeah, she's, 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 <laughs> she's one of them mm. but i mean are there any other uh, sports endeavors that you're thinking about doing soon uh, well, not that I'm thinking. I think I have I have a couple of uh, things that is coming up. Yeah. Uh, I don't want to disclose it here. Okay. But soon they will they will they will see me. I mean, on the on the on the on the on the line. Right. The sideline, but they won't see me taking off my shirts anymore. Shorts. Eh? Shorts. 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 Um. <laughs> maybe one day we will meet somewhere <laughs> and then we will swim together. Hey. Yeah. Benny, there is um, one other thing um, sure. Stepper Foundation and Implan Entertainment is bringing up. Mm -hmm. um, we're bringing to Ghana the first ever boot camp for kids. 
where kids can come and hang out with international footballers like himself, um, Samuel Oseko for guests in a handful right. during vacation. They will talk to them, inspire the kids, train with them, and give them a good time during their vacation. So it's okay. all coming up. Good stuff. Yeah. Well, thank you so much, all three of you, Gabriella, Stephen, and Stacey, for coming in and letting us know what's happening this weekend. I'll be there this weekend. Uh, what should I wear? Whatever uh, you're not wearing, because we uh, <laughs> just got his fashion sense nowadays is just unbelievable. Uh, it's not true, is he? Mr. Stephen. Oh, let's, oh, let, let, let Sandra tell me. Mm. Sandra. It? Yeah. Sandra, mm. what should I wear? We'll, we'll talk to Sandra. Are you bringing in a camera? <laughs> <laughs> Instagram. <laughs> oh, she has always on standby. But thank you so much, Gabriella, Stephen, and Stacey for coming in and telling us about this. And uh, congratulations once again. And we'll be there to honor you ourselves on Saturday. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay.